64 and today I have a special guest with me. Hello everybody, it's Blazekin Lad. And uh, let's get started. Let's get started where we last left off and I made a terrible joke. But uh, you know, it's all behind us now. So today, now, instead of hitting the door here, we're going to finish downstairs in the basement and then we are going to see what's upstairs. So let's see. Where'd I last leave off? What is left to do? Ah, dire, dire docks. Okay, that's it. All right. So, anyway, go ahead and do that. There we go. All right. So uh, it's been a little while since I've recorded this, but uh, how you guys been doing? I've been doing pretty good myself. So recently, uh, yeah, I'm not going to bring my job into this, but uh, no, forget it. I'd rather not bring my job into this. So, okay, so for this mission, we gotta find the right chest. And Mario will open them for me. Get them all in order, and well, we get the star. It's one of the hardest stars we can get. Let's see, am I doing that? Yeah, I'm, I'm doing that one. Okay. You think I get the top one last? I remember that. So, the top one is just gonna be a pain. I can tell you now. It's actually one of the hardest stars for me. I'll be easy for us. Hey, it's kind of difficult. Okay. Can you imagine if they like put a difficult option on this game? I would always go for hard. I don't care. Well, I'm dead. And that's why it's the hardest start for me to get. Oh, no. Mamma mia! Alright, so you're not talking about this one. Nothing. Alright. Take two and action. I wanna hook that man. I don't know, I might kill you. I might sting you. Move, clam. Thank you. Yeah, but the air bubbles right there, they were kill your health. Also, one of you kills your health, so I mean. Well, it's possible, but that's Mario logic. I brought that up in the past episode. Just how, how is Mario breathing with coins? I mean, really. There you go. Now, maybe if he you know, got oxygen tank okay, down here, I would understand that. But this is Mario. What I find interesting is that, like, Mario, Mario can somewhat breathe underwater, but Sonic can't. Well, in the past games, uh, Mario could breathe infinitely underwater. This one, however, cannot. For whatever reason, I guess to make it harder. Here we go! But uh, his move with the 3D is like, you know what, Mario needs to breathe. So let's add a. Uh, Mechanic where he freezes underwater. Okay, so we got 70 stars. We can actually go to the final boss right now. But that's not how I'm doing things. I'm 100%ing things. Because that's just how I am. Pole jumping for a up. This one's pretty easy. It's just it takes a minute. It takes precision. It just takes time. If you're not patient enough. Got it? Go splash. You're in the water. Yeah. That's why they give you the option to turn Mario around on the pole. Yeah, but sometimes that doesn't even help. You gotta, like, be precise which way you're turning. If not, you're just gonna go splash. The sun is still here. I have not been a second house yet, huh? I keep forgetting that. Okay. Still at Thank you. <laughs> you gotta be standing completely still, yeah. 
that will kill her. There we go. We're good. We're better now. Let's go fight a second Bowser because uh, I can't continue on without it. So. That bounce though. You got some air time on the ass. That's what you call a bubble butt. Alrighty, okay. Second Bowser. Yeah. 
Okay, so we we'll got the 100 coin star. Now we gotta swim away from this wall as fast as possible. Mario's facing the other way. No, but just, but just, Mario, don't face that way, thank you. <laughs> Alright, so, as soon as we get away from this wall, oh god. I think it's gonna stay soon. No, 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 we got it, we got it. We got this under control, it's just very strong force right there in that wall. If uh, you're too close to it, it'll pull you out of the level. And all the way up to that castle. Yeah, so you don't want that. What you want is to swim as fast as you can. And we're, we're good now. So if you hear button mashing, that's me trying to get away. Okay, so... At the risk of your thumb hurting like crazy. <laughs> eh, I'm used to it. Actually, it's the arm that gets damaged for me. Because I move my arm up and down as I go. Oh, why didn't you take that way? Because I can't get up that way, I have. I mean, I can. I like to do it. Move it this way. So, that's... We've only got one more star left. There are dogs here. And it's, I think, I'm right. It should be one of the easier ones. Yes, through the drift screen. It's actually the, the easiest level, the easiest star in this level. Oh, it's all cheap, cheap. That you can do. Okay, so people may have seen the shark going around. That shark does not do anything to Mario. It just swims around. It's just there for decoration. But I would like, I would like to see like a hack of this game. So that shark actually attacks you and then like kills you if you don't like get out of the water best. Yeah, but not like where it's like all mess or anything. Just keep it like this, just let's not get it creepy across the walls. Oh my god, no. There's enough of that going on after this. Yep. Okay, so this one is creepy. Oh, there we go. Too far out.
Anyway, I'm not a speedrunner, so I'm gonna go up here and get the metal cap. Yeah. A logical way to do it and get the star that way instead of a buck to swim. Run out here and get the star this way. So what I like about the metal cap is metal cap and and all that poison gas, uh -huh. it doesn't affect you and how you don't drown. When you don't drown, yeah. so you don't drown in here either. Okay, so I think that's all the worlds down here. Yep. All right. Yep, that's all. Okay. So now we head upstairs. So as soon as we go upstairs, I might just do a part. But you guys get to see what's upstairs. So here we go. Alright, uh, okay. <laughs> Alright, so normally, you know, you go upstairs normally, but uh, yeah. you jump up here, you just Ta -da! take a shortcut to the top of the stairs. Insert Zelda item by music. Yeah. Okay, so we have a couple worlds here. There's one. It's wet, dry world. The higher into the poster. Water they'll be. Yes. And then we have uh, Snowman's Land Part Two. Now, hold on. I want to explain something. Here. What would that be? The like two? No. Well, like two is your camera, obviously. Uh, but you can change camera by pushing the R button, and now Mario's in control. And like two, like two got a lot closer. But if you do that, it's like I'm going to stay like here. Anyway. Like, the reason you know that there is a painting right there on the wall is this painting oh. over here. That's, Whoa. that's how you know to jump in there. I didn't even think about looking at the mirror. Yeah. I just dove head first at it, hit the part where you don't go in. All of a sudden the wall just, just jiggles. Anyway, here's Tall Tall Mountain. I hate that one. I love that one. And yeah. Yeah. Tuck this toad instead of him up. You get a free star. Do you believe the rumors about Mario? Yeah. Or about him. Here we go. About be him being a psycho? Yeah. Uh, yes. What about the one where Bowser's is not so bad? I think I can believe that one. Okay, here's Tiny Huge Island. You got My favorite. I hate this one. You got Tiny World. On the other side. Huge World. Huge island. Okay, so yeah, I'm staying away from that one for a little bit. I don't really like it that much. But okay, so that's all the world is in this part. But since we've got over 50 stars, we can actually go in this door right here. And you just want to go ahead and beat the game. Just no, there's more, there's more levels. Tick-tock clock, one of my personal favorites. Tick-tock clock, which you can manipulate uh, how fast the thing moves inside. This toad here yeah, also star. gives you a star. Two of the stars you get right there. Here we go! But